Hell of an office, Juan. Danny, back from... Want me to make you the best Supremos and resolver weapons? You need depleted uranium. Lucky for you, Castillo has stashed his supply with the biggest guns on the island, his anti-aircraft cannons. When you got some of that... You'll be back! They always come back. Once you're back at Santuario, shake the trees for guns, ammo, new believers. Castillo was surprised. Let's keep it that way. Welcome to Libertad, Danny. I can leave any time. What's the rush? Inspiring. Let's free Yara, shall we? Castillo controls all of Yara with soldados, slaves, and blood. The capital is a stronghold. We take Esperanza, we free Yara. Best chance we got to weaken Castillo is to hit military targets like FND bases and checkpoints. But most important, we have to surround Esperanza and trap Castillo in his cage. That means targeted operations that will unite the revolution and make Libertad stronger. To do that, I need you to recruit three groups in Yara to fight with Libertad. Each is waging war across Yara with a different piece of Castillo's empire, all controlled by his inner circle. In El Este, foreign invaders like Mickey Industries suck our resources dry, and Admiral Benitez defends Castillo's poison lifeline. But the old legends of 67 can help us turn the tide. They're hiding in the jungles of the highest mountains of Yara. Their greatest guerrilla, El Tigre, is waiting with open arms to help you bring them on our side. Then we have Valle de Oro. Not just the engine of Castillo's Viviro operation, but also his propaganda machine, run by his Minister of Culture, Maria Marquesa. But I have some old friends who can run our counter-propaganda campaign, Maximas Matanzas. They were the voice of the protests and can mobilize Yara's dissidents to fight for Libertad. They've gone dark. Last seen at a fort in Balaceras. We need to find them before Castillo's forces do. In Madrugada, we have Castillo's nephew, Jose, a slave driver who forces outcasts to grow that poison Viviro tobacco. But the Montero family is waging war against Jose. They hate visitors, but I have intel on a mechanic who has a workshop in Costa del Mar. His name is Philip Barsaga, and he's their gatekeeper. If I were you, Danny, I'd start in Madrugada. We take back that tobacco with the Montero's help, and we got Castillo's Viviro at the source. You just need to find this mechanic, Philly. I'll be here actioning targeted Libertad strikes against Castillo throughout Yara. Hang on. I'm gonna get all these groups to sign up for Libertad by myself? How? Simple. You help. Any way you can. I send a squad to these groups, I'm an invader. I send a scout, then I'm not serious. With you, they get my best career without politics and bullshit. Just help. Libertad takes the capital, we slit Anton's throat, maybe drink his blood, etc., etc. Danny needs a walk. Viva Libertad, Jefa. Yeah, yeah. I'm not Tara's best guerrilla, you are. You're not listening. Translate, Juan. The accent. Clara hides it best she can, but she was born rich from a family of true Yaran she left behind. She can shoot, bleed, drink with us all she wants, but she can't hide the stink of the upper class. What's that have to do with me? You are an orphan, Danny. Poor, from the dirt. When they see you, they don't see politics. They see they have no excuse. She's using me. See? 
and you're using her right back. Do you want to kill Anton? See, si. you want to free Yara? Sure you do. But here's what Clara can't say, but you and I both know. You want this. You're a guerrilla. And for a guerrilla, the shit my pants rush of an ambush, the smell of sulfur burning your nostrils, it's... It's... It's fun. Don't worry. Your secret is safe with me. What kind of person works in a place like this? You Philly? I'm Danny. No, 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 feely here. Whoa, what's in your bag? Nowhere I can find him. Cerveza. So who's in charge? Everything got another purpose. And you come here for a second. Can you just come here? Can you hold that down for me? That's a dead man switch. One move. So, why are you here? I'm with Clara from Libertad. Didn't she say I was coming? Clara, Libertad. That's a big name to throw around. <laughs> but I don't see Clara. I only see you. So why are you here? Got family to save? Got kids? No. So what do you want out of this? I want my finger off this switch. And I want to know who's going to help me take down Castillo. OK. You're safe now. <laughs> so you're Clara's hero, huh? I'm no hero. That's what it's reward, reward. Philly magic, baby. Want us to help Libertad? You need Carlos Montero, <sighs> our backbone. His family is going to save our land. Great. Take me to him. No, 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 no. Step one, Philly needs to love you. Step two, baby Montero needs to love you. Baby Montero. <laughs> See that? Chorizo, come on, let's go back. <laughs> La Espada, his daughter. You know, last time I heard, she went to hit that outcast plantation east of here. She likes you, you're in. A good luck finding her. La Espada, oh, man, she's a fiera. <laughs> oh, 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 next time I see you, I want to play with that crazy backpack, dear. No. Well, then don't let the potion get you down. 
fucking comedian. Better take out that camera. This espada is in fucking around. Senor Presidente, for those yards, no! their heads in the sand. Shit, another one. The sword? 
They should call her the blade. Binga, she's fucking good. My fellow Yaren, always remember. Our Vivino is a modern miracle. A treatment that buys precious time for those suffering from the ravages of cancer. But our Vivino not only brings life to the world, it brings life to Yara. The wealth it provides is a cure for the cancer of socialist poverty that almost destroyed our nation. Viviro is progress. Viviro is life. Viviro is hope for every other. See you, sniper. What the fuck is happening up there? Stop! Please! Who the fuck are you? Danny, from Libertad. You, baby Montero? Baby Montero? <laughs> you fucking feely. I need to talk with your father. Clara? wants to make a deal. Clara's name doesn't mean shit around here. You work for Clara Garcia? You're Carlos Montero's daughter? Please don't kill me. Tell me where your lieutenant went. Promise you won't kill me first. Ah, Cayo Villarreal! Cayo Villarreal! It's so safe, private island. Got what you need? No, but it's enough. And him? 
And he's gonna tell his boss, Jose Castillo, that I'm gonna kill all of his lieutenants one oh. by one. Oh. That's for fun. Then I'm gonna free all of the outcasts making that bullshit tobacco. That's for my people. And finally, he's gonna tell Jose that I'm gonna slit his throat right aquí. And that, that's for me. I feel like I should write this down. Just tell that short little pig fuck this sword was here. And tell your friends they're on the wrong team. Let's go see Papa. We'll take the horses outside. Okay. Intruders! We got soldiers down! Intruders! Sounds like they found the bodies you sliced up. Military's going to be on our ass. Let's go. This way. Come on. Right behind you. Keep up and stay close, 
okay? Okay! Huh. Go! That's a good horse. Went pretty good, no? Come on. You see now. Okay, I think we lost them. See, we're good. You ride well. You're not bad yourself. Where did you learn to shoot like that? Military academy. 16 to 21. Mm, we can use that. I also make a mean mojito. <laughs> Believe that when I taste it. I haven't had anything but Philly septic tank shit for weeks. I'm going to pretend that's not a thing. Seems like Castillo's made things pretty rough out here. His nephew Jose is the real problem for us. We call that tiny bastard Napoleon the Pequeño. Little Napoleon? Cute. The name is cuter than the man. The Monteros have been on this land for 200 years, and now he's turned it all into slave camps for that Vivido bullshit. Jose works our people non-stop with a gun to the head. Mamirda even took my papa. He was in those fields too long. Poison made him sick. Not that he'd ever admit it. Now papa leads a little revolution of his own. You're going to need libertad if you want to stop Castillo. You're not the first one to tell me that. But papa's got a bit of pride in him. <laughs> Only trusts his own blood. You're a Montero or you're a nobody. So what you're saying is, I'm fucked. <laughs> I, I don't know. There's something different about you. You're not like the others, Clara said. Maybe he'll like you. Maybe. How far away is this camp of yours? Not far. You in a rush? No, no. It's okay. Getting some good cardio in. Now, guerrera. The sword and the hero. <laughs> nice to see you two alive. Not all find it, Hannah. Oh. It was all trouble, but lucky for you, this one's good. <laughs> well, you're just in time. I'll have his making dinner. Bullshit. Who's that? My name is... I'm not asking you. Easy, Papa. This is Danny from Libertad. Libertad don't mean shit to me. And where's our blindfold? Papa, look around. These are farmers, not fighters. You want Chorizo to go out and blow up Napoleon and Pequeño? Hey, 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 hey. Leave Chorizo out of this. <laughs> our people need to learn to be a guerrilla, Camila. From us. That's why I'm here. Don't look like no guerrilla to me. All I see is a tourist. The tourist fucks us. It's on you, Camila. He likes you. Welcome to Finca Montero, hero. Come on, Choris. 
Save it for the sir, buddy. Come on. 